Police say a fingerprint led them to a man now accused of raping eight women on the east side. That series of rapes started last summer and continued through this month. 37-year-old Daryl Goodlow is charged with rape, burglary, and assault. Detectives claim Goodlow would use some sort of ruse with his victims before pushing his way into their homes, hiding his face, disguising his voice, and then tying them up. Investigators say they had few leads before they discovered that fingerprint on a house fan from the attack two weeks ago. The assault that occurred on September the 8th, and in that assault, um, the suspect had had moved a fan in the in the home of the victim, and we were uh, crime lab did an amazing job. They lifted a print, identified the print. We would have liked to have wrapped it up, you know, after one case, um, but we we had very little to go on. He um, he he made sure that he kept himself covered. Goodlow is expected to appear in court Thursday morning. IMPD is also looking at other unsolved rapes to see if there are similarities or a DNA connection to Goodlow's case. CBS4 first asked IMPD about a series of rapes when they put out a warning in June. IMPD wouldn't talk about the case at that time. Two more rapes were committed after that. A family member of one of the victims says if police had given more of a warning, her loved one may not have been attacked. In response, IMPD says their top priority was the interest of victims and potential victims, adding they had to balance protecting the public with protecting the information known by police and the potential to cause, quote, unnecessary fear. To see that full statement, visit CBS4Indy.com.